all right let's quickly solve this uh, bearing question please if you have not watched our first and second video on bearing please do so it will help you to understand this okay they said a boat sell six kilometer from a port x from a port x on a bearing of 65 that 65 is first quadrant so let me draw it here so that it will go like this first quadrant so this is 65 from here to here is that 0 65 so you cut like this and cut like this so if here is 65 automatically here is 65 okay so please cut with a straight line So here is what 65. Okay. So from a port X, I don't know where it's going to. Thereafter. Okay, six kilometer. Six kilometer. Then thereafter, 13 kilometer on a bearing of 126. 126. This is where this thing is now. And then he now went 126. 126 is second quadrant, which is this side. So this is 126. So let me shift my let me shift. Let me shift. So let me do it here. This is the 65. From here to here is 65. So automatically here will be 65. So this is the X on what? 6 kilometer. So this is where it is now. And then 136. 136 is second quadrant. So it will be somewhere here. I made this one longer because this is 13 kilometers, so it should be longer than 6 kilometers. So you cut like this and cut like this. So now join this one from here to here. You see, you are done. Bearing is very, very simple. So the 126 is what? Start it is here now. So starting from the north, till you touch here. Is that 136? So the remaining side should be what? 180 minus 136. So I'm having four here. Uh, and four here, so 44. So from here to here, we'll give you uh, 109. You are done. The question now said, What is the bearing? What is the distance and the bearing from X? This is the last point of this. Let me say they come to Y and then Z. So we need the bearing of X from the last point, which is from the X now, which is starting from the, the north till you touch this man that that comes from the last point so i need this place once i can get this place i will not say what well, 65 plus this place is the bearing that's all so the distance is from here to here and once they gave you two sides and one angle in between the two sides what do you use cosine rule don't forget according to what i taught you in trigonometry so if you have not watched my video on trigonometry please do so so the distance is small y we'll say that what small y squared is equal to what x squared Min, uh, plus z squared minus 2 the same x the same z cos that y so which is what y squared is equal to start from this side 6 squared plus 12 squared sorry plus 13 squared minus 2 times the same 6 times the same 12 13 sorry then cos 109 so therefore my y squared is equal to uh, let us do that so I have um, 6 squared is 36 plus 169, okay? So let's do cos uh, 106, 109, cos 109 is giving us minus. So minus with this minus will make here plus. So times, times 13, times 13 times 12 okay i'm having 50 so 50 plus um 36 plus 169 so i have um 36 plus 169 36 plus 
Okay, so my y square is equal to 255. So y is now what? The square root of 255, which is equal to 15.9. So 15.9. So that is the distance between them kilometer. So it's very simple. So to get to get the angle, this angle now, I can use sine rule. I can say sine 109 over the one I have, which is 15.9. Sine this over this is equal to sine this theta over the one that is facing it 13. So therefore, sine theta is equal to 13 sine. 109 divided by what 15.9 so sine theta is equal to let's do that one zero nine sine times fifty times what thirteen Okay, now divided by 15.9. So I'm having 0 0.7731. So therefore, my theta will not be what? Sine inverse of that 0 0.7731. So I'm having a sine inverse. So 50. I'm having 50. Point six, which is what 51 degrees to the nearest whole number. So the bearing, you will not tell them if here is um, 51 degrees, you will not tell them that the bearing, the bearing of X from, so the bearing of the boat from X, the bearing of the boat from X. Is starting from here till you touch that line, which is what 65 plus theta, which is uh, 65 plus theta, which is what 65 plus 51, which is um, 6 11 116 degrees. See, that's very simple. Once you can draw this, what you are now applying is only um, sine or cosine rule. Thank you very much for watching.